Hi there, my name is Elton Lum. I'm part of the field sales team here at QNX. I'm going to walk you through the demo here in the Ford Mustang Mach E GT. So this is a current generation example of software defined vehicles. In this case, QNX is powering four domains in this particular model. If we start here on the left hand side with the cluster, we'll see that it is now a digital gauge and in it, it because of QNX, able to show both safety critical elements such as the gear selector or telltales along the bottom as well as non-safe elements such as the range or the battery battery meter if we move over to the center console we'll see here this is a nice big tablet for the infotainment system very much like a phone being able to do everything a consumer would expect to do on a typical phone today again this is powered by qnx and as we can see here very much everything every uh, someone would expect on a phone with consumer applications as an Android Auto or Apple CarPlay. So that's the second domain here. As well, it in integrates our acoustic technology, that being echo cancellation noise reduction to enable hands-free operation. The third domain that QNX powers here is the gateway, which includes tel telematics capabilities. So here, as we go down to see software updates, we can see that the vehicle automatically is checking for updates. With software defined vehicles, nowadays any feature can be updated, can be enhanced through software technology, and it doesn't just stop at the factory floor when the car is created. Now, once the car is purchased, updates can happen, new features can be added to enhance the consumer experience. Finally, the last domain, the last safety critical domain that is using QNX is the driver assistance or the ADAS system within this vehicle. Again, nowadays in modern vehicles, we are seeing level two, level three type capabilities in autonomy. In this case, we see all the various options such as lane keep assist, uh, traffic pilot monitoring, driver alert. In here, there's a built-in camera in the cabin to note the drivers. So these type of features are all being powered by QNX in a safety critical subsystem and all being controlled here and shown in the infotainment system.